What is up, guys? I'm your real Soto. Now, I have a really interesting video for you guys today. Now, have you guys ever wondered how to view a website's plugins or themes? Let's say you're going through their website and you really like their theme and you kind of like what they have going on with specific um, maybe widgets on their website or specific features and you're wondering um, how can I get those those features or the theme on my website, right? Um, and you're kind of trying to figure that out. Well, I actually found a really simple solution to finding out a website's plugins or themes if they're using WordPress, of course. So what you guys need to do is it's really simple. Go to that website, go ahead and right click it, and then go ahead and click on inspect. And then from here, don't worry um, how this looks right now. What you need to worry about is this column here. Now, if for some reason you don't have this column um, selected on there, what you want to do is go ahead. Let me go ahead and exit out of this again, just in case you guys do have that issue here. Most likely it will come up, but if it doesn't, um, just make sure that console is selected down here. And then go ahead and go to your sources. And then over here, you'll, you'll see that this is open up. Now, I am using a local... Um, server right now so that's why you see dev site local but usually you'll have the website's name and then you can click on that and then under that you'll see wp content and if some of you are familiar with the file structure of wordpress you know where i'm going with with this so go ahead and open up wp content and then you'll see plugins now go ahead and click on plugins and then it'll open right up and it'll literally tell you the name of each plugin so this one obviously i'm using elementor i'm using elements kit I'm um, using header, header footer, Elementor, and WP Forms. Now you're probably wondering, well, what theme am I using, right? Well, if you go in here and click on themes, and then you can go ahead and see that it's it says theme slash Astra. So right here, I'm using Astra. That's the theme that I'm using, and I'm actually using their starter sites. You guys can easily import this site. I do have a video on that on my channel. You guys can go ahead and check that out. You guys can also view uploads and other stuff like that. If you guys did want to view that as well um, and then just in case for some reason you go through the site and you're not seeing this um, you know you're not seeing this area just go ahead and open some of these some of these will actually be the will actually be the website and you can go ahead and view that they are the structures sometimes is a little bit different um, but you guys can go ahead and go through that and find the theme or plugin um, that's pretty much it. That's also a good way to find out if the word if the website is running on WordPress as well. You don't really have to go and and uh, go on a different website, uh, type in their link, and then the website. You know how the website usually tells you if it's WordPress or not. I know that there's a bunch of extensions and websites that do that for you. This way, it's so much easier. You don't have to download or do any of that. Just right click it, go to inspect, and then go to sources. And then if it says WP content, you most likely know that it's a WordPress website. Now that is pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys did find this helpful. Um, I know that I was pretty excited when I found this out. So I did want to share that with you guys. So if you guys did like this video, make sure to uh, make sure to subscribe and like the video. And as always, thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next video.